Welcome back to Chalkline Crime and this educational video. The year was 2009. A woman walking her dog in Albuquerque, New Mexico, stumbled upon a human bone. The authorities were alerted and what they uncovered was beyond belief. Buried in the arid desert land lay the remains of 11 women and a fetus, all hidden from the world's eyes. Thus began the chilling tale of the West Mesa bone collector. In the years leading up to this discovery, from 2001 to 2005, the city of Albuquerque had seen an alarming number of women go missing. All of them shared a disturbingly similar profile, young, Hispanic, and involved in the city's sex trade. Yet despite their families' pleas, these cases remained low priority, lost in the city's bureaucratic maze. The discovery of the bodies in 2009 sent shockwaves through the city. The scale of this crime was unprecedented for Albuquerque. The authorities now had a serial killer on their hands, one who had operated under their noses for years. The subsequent investigation was massive, the largest in the city's history. It involved local, state and federal agencies, all working tirelessly to unmask the West Mesa bone collector. Despite their efforts, the killer's identity remained elusive. As the investigation unfolded, several suspects emerged. Among them, a local pimp known as Lorenzo Montoya and a businessman named Joseph Blee. Montoya was killed in 2006, while Blee is currently serving a 90-year sentence for unrelated crimes. However, despite circumstantial evidence, neither man has been definitively linked to the West Mesa murders. Fast forward to today, the case remains unsolved. The identity of the West Mesa bone collector continues to be a mystery. The families of the victims still wait for justice, their pain a stark reminder of the lives brutally cut short. In conclusion, the West Mesa bone collector case is a chilling tale of a city's darkest secret. A tale of 11 women whose lives were tragically ended and their bodies discarded like they were nothing. Despite the tireless efforts of law enforcement, the identity of the killer remains unknown. The West Mesa Bone Collector continues to be an enigma, a faceless perpetrator of a crime so horrific it's almost beyond comprehension. A grim reminder that sometimes the monsters we fear are not in the shadows, but walking amongst us.